Hey guys, this is Matt Beck from freesaloneducation.com and I am going to do a video right now that I've been waiting to do. Um, this is just a quick way on how to maintain your scissors. I've seen a lot of hairdressers do it different ways, but I've talked to Mizutani and I've gotten the lowdown on exactly what you should do and should not do. So here's a couple things. Um, your scissor, you don't need to take it apart every single night and clean it out because what's going to happen is you're going to wear down the screw and it's not going to work the same. It's not going to go back together the same. A lot of companies even put together different, um, I've heard of different companies that have screws that as soon as you take them off, you can't get them back on. So be careful with that. Um, the system basically works like this. You need a box of these, which you should have in your salon anyways. And this guy is our Mizutani oil. The thing I like about this oil, it comes with every scissor that you get from our shop uh, on freesaloneducation.com. But it has a nice little needle on it. Uh, the oil is great. It's made for the scissor. Don't be using wall clipper oil or whatever spray oil you have. You need a really nice scissor oil. Um, and the thing I like about Mizutani scissors, some of them, uh, definitely the, the blacksmith fit has a hole in it that you can place the needle and put in your oil. So what you wanna do at the end of the night after you get done cutting hair is take a Kleenex because it's nice and soft. I like to work through the top of the scissor and clean that off first. Get all my fingerprints off of it. You wanna take care of your tools. You're spending a lot of money on them. Then open it up and I'm just gonna slide the tissue along the blade, get the hair off there, wipe it there in the back. So wipe both blades off. You can see there's a little bit of hair, you probably can't see, but there's a little bit of hair in there, so I'm just cleaning that out. And then what I'm gonna do, after I do that, take the oil, put it in the little hole here, and just do a little couple drops of oil. Open the scissor up, close it, and then I'm just gonna do two drops of oil on the blade. Nothing crazy, you don't have to uh, overload it. This oil should last you forever. Um, and then just close the, the scissor, don't open it a whole bunch, wipe it off, and it's set to go. You should do this every single night before you, after you finish in the salon so it's ready for the next day. It's disgusting when you open up your scissor case and not only is your scissor case overflowing with hair, but your scissor has hair from every haircut you did the day before anyways, and it's not good on the blade. It's gonna ruin your blade. So um, if you don't wanna sharpen your scissors that often, you wanna save money that way, buy a nice pair of scissors, take care of them, and you know, so hopefully this helps you. Uh, this is a something that I've wondered for a long time. I've seen all different types. So this is the easiest way to take care of your scissors. So make sure you subscribe to us on YouTube, follow us on Facebook, Free Salon Education, and also on Instagram, Free Salon Education. We'll check you out on the next video. Thanks.